Did I just get two levels? I didn't get my first perk, and now they're giving me my second one. I don't even know what's going on. Your action points and carry weights increase depending on the total number the total number of current companions. That's actually pretty cool. Now I gotta pick something. Hold on. I'm gonna take gunslinger. More AP with pistols. What the hell? That's six thousand experience for that quest? Are you kidding me? That's a bit much, isn't it? Also, I only got the one perk. And then my game crashed. Great. Alright, I have done absolutely everything I can to try to fix it. Turns out, the reason I'm not getting a perk every level is because Imbam has three or four mods that set your level cap to 200 something and or give you more than one give you a perk every level well the problem is is if you have one mod that increases your level cap and another mod that increases you know makes it to where you get a perk every single level then the perk every level won't work and if you have two mods that both do either one, or that both remove. Ah! If you have two mods that make it to where you get a perk every level, then neither one of them will work. Level uncapper always works, you know, setting your max level to 200, but the rest of it don't. Which effectively results in the highly annoying situation. that I am currently visiting. No matter what I do, it is not possible for me to actually get a perk every single level. Which sucks. It really does. But, oh well. You know, I've considered the alternative of manually adding perks, and I've decided against it simply because, first of all, I'd have to look up those damn things, and I'd have to figure out which mod each perk I want came from, and it's just not worth the effort. Because you don't need all those perks. They'd just be nice to have. You know, I tried to, I tried to remove the problematic portions of code from, or changes, they're not really code or script or anything, they're just kind of references, but I tried to remove the problematic references, and it didn't do any good. You know, I went in with the GEC and I changed them back to defaults. And then I went in with the scrubber and TES snip. I used both to delete the references. Because even if you move it back to default, it's been changed once. So you have to actually delete the reference. And the only reason you bother moving it back to default is just in case. Because if you delete the reference, the game shouldn't check. They, got spies they shouldn't look at that, so even if the number in the GEC doesn't change, it's not going to affect the game.
But yeah, it didn't work when you get down to it. And Mr. Smooth Skin, that's not a smooth skin, Lumpy, I'm going to call him Lumpy. Lumpy was supposed to move here. Howdy. I'm not seeing him. I think there's actually some other stuff I can do here. I'm only light here. I'd rather be idolized. You know, it's real easy to become vilified everywhere. One problem that persists in every game ever made that isn't strictly you have to be evil. Being evil doesn't really work all that hard. Just like non-combat will never be worth as much experience as combat. Non-evil will never work as well as evil. Wait a minute. No. Non-good will never work as well as good. Never mind. I don't know if you know, but since Jeannie May passed, I've been keep. I think it's time we gave everything back to you. So take this key and make yourself at home at our motel. It'll open the room on the second floor, closest to the lobby. Hope it suits you. There we go. Nobody seems to care that the lady's dead. If you killed her yourself, because it doesn't have to be from Boone's quest that she dies, as long as she's dead. But if you kill her yourself, he still won't care. He'll be perfectly happy to give you a room, and you can tell him that, and he just seems rather disaffected by it. At least I'm pretty sure it's him and her that is the right kill and talk to the replacement conversation. You want a guy? You want to go hunt some bottleheads? May lead you to a bobblehead approximately 50% of the time. When they do not help, search locations relevant to each bobblehead. It said that Jacob was a strong man. Been on the wrong side of the law and they'll come here to get you. To end you. To dig in the earth is no easy feat. And this broken piece of scrap metal proves it. Give me food, give me money, give me gambling, and baby, I'm in heaven. Well, I bet this one's somewhere on the strip. <laughs> At least parachutes are cool. I guess the lucky 38's where that would be. And babies?
Well, that's a shame. Hell, the hint for this thing, the medicine bottle head, just because they're religious doesn't mean they don't know their way around a scalpel. Didn't I find that stupid thing in the doctor's house? Yeah, I did. So I don't see how any of those clues, uh, riddles, random bits of dialogue <laughs> are really going to help me. So, no, I'm not going to go hunting for the bobbleheads. I may find one or two, but it'll be pure luck. And actually, strike that. I have bad luck. I won't find any. Quest completed, locations discovered, people killed, creatures killed. Hell, I've picked almost as many lockpicks as I've killed people. We're very good and we're a shepherd. Boy, he's cracked seven computers? Really? Only addicted twice. I haven't really done much, have I? Total thing killed is under 500. I've crippled that many wins almost. 73,000 gold. Well, sort of. It's not actually gold, but whatever. This full of hollers. Kill enemies using. Oh, this is challenges, I see. Got the one for killing people with guns. Haven't messed with melee weapons. Need to start using my rifle again. Shoot him up again. Still need to use my gun. Nuke it from orbit. I don't even use solar mounted things. There are two more powder ganger leaders. Kill enemies with explosives. Nice large two handed weapon to kill enemies. I've almost got I can kill you with one hand. Kill robots, we're getting close. Almost got Bug Stomper. Only one more animal to go. A lot more. That's all the challenges there are. Kill a certain number of people. Well, now I think about it, I didn't see any on there that I didn't have at least one board. Maybe they don't show up until you've done at least one. No, I didn't have any melee kills. Toxic dump site. Oh, this is great. You know, frankly, I've kind of lost track of what I was doing. Maybe I should take a look at my uh, quest screen. See if there's a quest I can pick back up that I'd already started. And now I've got my 50. With Animal Control Rank 3. It's actually pretty awesome. Animals don't fight me on their own. And I can really kick their ass. 